I want to welcome you to my life where I succeed and you succeed. We all succeed together. Remember, be an inspiration through love and motivation. I got all the entertainment that you want. Vlogs, challenges, story times, and you name it. They only see green from them purple eyes. They eyes high, they eyes high. I'm wasted. Being the kids lick for gold. We in a whole different mode. The kid that used to pitch bricks. What's up with it? You're back with another day with Jack Quinn. And today, I'll be doing my second review. This will be my first music review of an album. You know who I'm uh, doing this review for. Uh, Jay-Z 444 album, which just released this past Friday. Oh, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Let's jump into the business. Let's do it. Hey, we back on the track. Hey, I'm going to bust a flow because... I might be back on next uh, album. Hey, might be coming with it, but uh, let's go ahead and get to 444. This first track, which is called Kill Jay Z. Kill Jay Z. They'll never love you, you'll never be enough. Let's just keep it real, Jay Z. Fuck Jay Z. In love with Jay Z. You got people you love, you sold drugs to. You got high on life, that shit drunk you. You walking around like you invincible. You dropped out of school, you lost your principles. I know people backstab you. I feel 13 bottles of Ace of Spade would have did the false step. All right, all right. Now, I already went through the whole album, did my homework. But um, this first track, let me go ahead and give y'all a breakdown of what I think of it. Um, I like the content. I like what he brings as far as the the musical instrumentals and everything. Now I noticed he took some. He so he said he he got to do better for Blue. Um, he took some shots at Kanye, Solange, Future. Um, even said he didn't even need to go Eric Benet, which I didn't see. Uh. Eric Benet respond to that and also another way well Kanye responded with uh with saying with quitting title I'm not, not, not sure if it's true or not but uh more than likely it is but um let's go ahead and get into uh you know track two which is the story of OJ <laughs> Take your drug money and buy fun at you, freedom, my only hope. Get real chances, uh, you on like nigga, dark nigga, faux nigga, real nigga. Don't die over the neighborhood that your mama rentin'. Take your drug money and buy Sean Cutlery. I like that second one. Yeah, That's a hit right there. Hey, I can say I like that hook. I like that hook for sure. If anything else, I like that hook. He got me with it. And you know, I, I'm a songwriter, so you know, I'm I'm feeling the vibe of the music as, as far as I'm concerned with the instrument. I believe I might be able to write something to it, but uh, the hook and he gave me with this. He gave me with that first line of the first verse. Uh, he says, Still, nigga. OJ like, I'm not black, I'm OJ. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, right there. <laughs> I'm not black, I'm OJ. Okay. <laughs> he gave me one right there. All right, this third track, Smile, featuring Gloria Carter, which is his mother. Good morning. I 
hot in the closet, so she medicate. Society shame and the pain, what's too much to take? Cry tears of joy when you fell in love. Don't matter to me if it's a him or her. I just wanna see you smile through all the hate. Maria Antoinette, baby, let them meet Kate. Bad times turn to good memories. Smile. Even when I'm gone and you remember me. Smile. Good times never fade away. Smile. Even if I'm not, would you hear today? Smile. Good morning. Alright, 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 alright. Um, that was some good little shit, but I ain't trying to get copyright. So, um, this, this third one, this third track, Smile, featuring his mother, Gloria Carter. Um, he goes through, um, he goes through the story, um, telling the story of his mother's sexuality. Mm. I mean, day and time where we live in. I don't know. Um, it's not my place to judge. It's in between him and the man right there, up there, and her. It's not my place. Like, you do what you do. I ain't got no, I ain't mad at you. Whatever you do, it's what you do. I can't judge you. It's not my spot. So, I mean, Hey, but I like the song. is a good song. It's a good song, and like I say, he provides lyrical content that's that's adamant and good. So let's go on here, get into four, track four, called "Their Eyes," featuring Frank Ocean. Ready for it. Hey. To these haters, don't give me that. You know the world can see just how phony you act, bruh. Your body language is on. So it seems, so you see. Uh -huh. I get past you, ain't auction off the cast. Don't big bro me, don't big homie. I seen pure admiration. I sat down with Prince eye to eye. He told me his wishes before he died. Now all right, all right, all right. That was called their eyes. Uh, he talked to Prince before he died, face to face, whatever. I ain't gonna say it was right, that was the last thing Prince did, but I mean, it was probably some months or weeks ago, but whatever. Uh -oh. I like the, the content, as I say, as always, I've been saying it throughout this whole review. He's been providing aid and good music. Um, I like that though. And let's go ahead and get to five. Four, four, four. The title track of the album. Hey, let's get to it. Do I find it so hard? When I know. I was when you were on tour. Please pick up the phone, pick up the phone. I said, don't embarrass me instead of be mine. That was my proposal for us to go steady. That was your 21st birthday. You mature faster than me. I wasn't ready, so I apologize. All right, all right. I mean, the lyrics that you hear are self-explanatory. Who's he speaking of? Speaking to his wife, Beyonce, who we all know. But um, he basically apologizing throughout this whole track. Um, and I guess you can call the album Beyonce, my wife, uh, I'm sorry. Whatever his version of sorry, basically stating, um, yeah. So he's speaking on his infidelity in the relationship. You heard it. <laughs> I ain't gonna even go there, but uh, I like the song. I mean, he did what he did. He did not mess up no more. But um, let's go ahead and get to number six, Family Feud. My nigga got on. I'm through a lot. I run through them all. Police home, all these phonies come to a halt. All this old talk left me confused. You'd rather be old rich me or new you. And old niggas, I stop back in brand new. Black owned champagne, and we merrily, merrily eating off these streams. That's like saying I'm the tallest midget. This when the family feels. We all screwed cause we never had the tools. I'm trying to fix you. I'm trying to get these niggas with no sh 
all right, all right. And now it's Family Feud. Um, throughout this song, he mentioned Al Sharpton. Uh, I think we got some vocals from B out of this track. I don't know if that's her or not. Um, he's speaking about his family. Uh, living life with his family. Uh, he mentioned uh, Becky better leave him alone. So, we know who Becky is. We don't know who Becky is, but it was a Becky. And it wasn't no alter ego of Beyonce. But, yeah, it was a Becky involved, and she better leave him alone. <laughs> Shoes. But, once again, he did it. Now, let's go on here again to seven. This is, a, this is my favorite track on the, of the album. Bam, featuring Damien, Damien Marley. Tell me if I pronounced that right. Sean was on that gospel shit. I was on the total fucking opposite. Shit. Stuff a million dollars in a sock drawer. That's a ball chest in case you need your chest knocked off. Y'all be talking crazy under the IG pictures. So when you get the hell, you tell them Blanco sent you. I can't take no dress, I got a set of twins Those were just the words you never hear again For the final time you don't believe these Alright, 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 he did that So, <laughs> Like I said, that's my favorite check on, on the album Hey, that uh, Instagram line How people be talking crazy under, under them comments It's true, cause I didn't have people come at me But uh <laughs> The instrument is on point. D Damian Marley part is on point. The lyrics are on point. The songwriting process was must have been killing it. I wish I was there for that whole process. I ain't even had to put in no input, but I wish I was there just to watch it. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and get to Moonlight, which is track eight on the album. He got the same fucking flows. I don't know who is who. He got the same fucking. Look, I know killers, you know killer, huh? On the internet, I just pose a threat. Blame the ass for that. I don't be on the gram. Go ahead, giving information to the park. That's all spam. Please don't talk about guns that you ain't never gonna use. Mm, that track right there. That's just, he's speaking on all these young, new cats, or anybody in general, basically, better yet, because I didn't pass across some few of, that, of those. Speaking, if you're going to rap about it, talk about it, be, be about it, and, and be the one that pr practice what you preach. Exactly. Don't be out here lying. Saying you do this, but you not, you ain't, you don't even do it. Be real with yourself. Rap about experiences that you really been through, that you really go through. Talk about, talk about it, write about it, whatever. Put it in a book, put it in a novel. Be vlog about it, cause some of these YouTubers too. But uh, I'm gonna leave it at that. Just be, be, be real with yourself. Be you. Shoes. And let's go ahead and get to Mercy Me. We should track nine. Yeah. Hurt you if you have not. Or better yet, here's a verse from Hamlet. Lord, we know who we are, yet yeah, we know not what we may be. So maybe I'm the one, or maybe I'm crazy. I'm from Marcy Houses where the boys die by the on the bandwagon, don't abort. Marcy Me. Shut out the Nostranad, flushing that Myrtle. All the county of kings make your ground stay fertile. Shut out the big pop. Oh, Marcy, Marcy, me. Just the way. All right, all right. Mercy me. That one right there. <laughs> like I said, throughout the whole album, he has did his thing. The words. The content he used, the production—I'm gonna say personally—the production on this song 
was on point. All teams across the board. Whoever wrote, uh, whoever worked on this song with him, from production, producing it, to whatever extra come along with that, teams across the board for that song. They did that. Hey, he did that. Now let's go ahead and get to this last track, Legacy. Generation of wealth, that's the key. My parents ain't have shit, so that shift started with me. My mom took up money, she bought me bombs. That was the sweetest thing of all time, uh. Legacy, 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 legacy. Black excellence, baby, you gon' let them see. Legacy, 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 legacy. Black excellency, baby, let them see. This is basically a letter to the let uh, a song to Blue and the Twins. Um, how he gonna pass down his traditions or whatever? Start tra traditions, start a legacy, leave leave uh, leave his legacy within his kids, children, hands or whatever. How is how he gonna live on through his children once he passes or whatever? Um, Black excellence is what he's defined as himself, um, his family. Um, let me just go on. Yeah, that song right now. <laughs> Aced it. Um, let me go ahead and give you an album review. <laughs> this full album. 10, 10, 10 stars. Hey, 4, 4, 4. 4, 4. Four across the board. A hundreds. Eight, ten, ten, tens across the board with this album. I'm impressed. I'm I wouldn't say I'm impressed. I'm not shocked. I mean I'm pleased with it. I like it. I love it. I'll be jamming this album for the next few few months. Until I, until I run across about some something else. But um, I'm going to be jamming this album for a while. 444. And this is going to be your review for the day. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment down below what else you would like to see from me. Um, go check out my past videos. And I'll be bringing you more content very soon. Hey. I'm going to go ahead and leave y'all with this clip, though. Hey, and I'm out. Like and subscribe. Please don't forget. What you got to do better, boy, you owe it the blue. If you had no father, you had the armor. But you got a daughter, got to get softer. Die, Jay-Z. Million. Guess how I'm feeling. Dumbo. Light nigga, dog nigga, faux nigga, real nigga, rich nigga, poor nigga, house nigga, feel nigga.